Hey guys, Jamie and today on Roblox we're playing some of Monsters of Ethereum as you can see on the screen right now. Also, if you guys haven't noticed, uh, we have actually haven't uploaded Monsters of Ethereum for a couple of days, well, mostly like a couple of weeks now. Mainly for the fact that I've been waiting for Lumion Legacy to come out, obviously I've been wanting this game for a long time. So I thought I'd take a break from um, Monsters of Ethereum just to go grind for that game. And we'd actually got pretty far in it, for uh, at least for Gleamings, which is the shiny alteration but anyway we're back doing some more monsters of Ethereum. so i've got like four new monsters so i think what i'll probably do over the next couple of days is just do how-to videos on how to unlock all of them i'm guessing most people have already got them unlocked but i thought why not do them anyway because like i said every now and then i will do like a how to unlock every monster video which also it will be updated every now and then so i might as well do them now so then i actually remember in the future actually how to unlock them but anyway let's get straight on to it then i guess in this video we'll show you i'll show you how to unlock flyden I think this one is the butterfly, I might be wrong though, but it says also to crack the code within the underground lab. So for this one, you can either go the long way around, which is also to go through the, um, is it the Feral's evolution? I forgot what it's called, mutation, I forgot what it's called. We can also go that way, or you can just use um, something with defog, which is probably what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, grab myself avian. Because also Avian knows uh, Defog, and then I'm just going to go through this way. I think this way is a lot quicker, so if you don't have a Defog, then also you have to go the long way around. But I'd recommend this way, because I'm pretty sure it's like a lot, a lot quicker. Anyway, here we are. Examine, confirm. Okay, it's cleared, and we just go straight through here. And, oh, um, there's all of there's all of these around, but we don't, we don't need to worry about that. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. Someone actually told me what the, uh, the, the code actually was. And there's that one. Oh, so that one's the seventh one, so zero seven. I don't know what the, z the zero means, but I guess these are around everywhere. But pretty much what you want to do is also come over to this, and it says, A strange console sits before you. It seems to require a code. So I think the code, if I quickly just pull it up from uh, someone's message. Okay, here we are. So apparently it is up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, then B, A? Yeah, B, A. You enter the code, you suddenly begin to feel the tingle of static electricity. You found Flyden, which that is how to unlock it. So really quickly, I'm just going to go look at it, because again... Oh, actually, it's the moth thing. Nice! I've been waiting for this one for so long to come out. It's actually a really, really cool one. Idea, and also models made by Me Thunder, um, and animated by a wolf fragment, which looks pretty cool. Again, can't evolve it yet. I don't actually know what level you have to get it to to evolve it, but pretty cool. I'm going to quickly use a... Um, a max voucher on it just so we can actually level up really quickly max voucher and let's go have a look at the um the pick speed so there we are anyway so if you know we've all i've also done some videos on um the on, on this thing especially on on this mo even more monsters that have been in the etherpedia um place which also i do like Oh, and these new monsters are coming out, and this is like our first look at them. I've really been wanting this, like a moth thing. They could definitely do this thing like the that one Pokemon, I think it's Vivleon, where I, they can like change its wings. So this one I definitely feel like would be like a, a lot of future codes, a lot of future like events, because I feel like this is a very easy monster for them to actually uh, update. And you can see it's kind of glitching, which uh, I didn't think about that, but I guess it's actually an electric type? I didn't really look at that, let's have a look. It is an electric wind and its evolution is as well, so pretty cool. Also, the artwork is by Ban I Kitty. Um, I, I guess I just never really do um, art for the first forms, which I guess is okay. But no, we have Stunning. Getting damaged by a contact attack may paralyze the opponent. Vault up paralysis caused by this monster lasts longer. And Timid, getting damaged by this physical attack may raise the monster's speed temporarily. And second farm is all the same. So then, weaknesses, only weak to like three things, but really it's not really weak to anything. Those are really, really, not they're not like, they're not going to hit super hard. And a lot of resistances, again, but they don't, most of them really don't do anything. But really good speed, really good energy, and other stats are like, okay. So, um, pretty cool. Um, let's have a quick read of these. The flutter of its wings slightly distorts the space around it, seemingly defenseless. Predators commonly attack Flyden only for it to warp just out of reach or teleport to a safe area. That feels like it, so I guess it's kind of like a, has kind of like a Rotom vibe, kind of, where like it's kind of like a glitch and also we found it like in a machine, so I wonder if it's like, 
a moth and you just got stuck in something because of bright lights, obviously, and then you just got the electric type. I actually wonder how Leia, I wonder how Me Funder actually came up with this idea. And Pixby, it's Destabizer, Destab, I can't say that word, I'm so dumb. It's the the stabilize oh, the stabilizers. It stabilizes the space near it, resulting in psychics behaving unexpectedly when something comes into contact with it. Pixie B avoids threats by vibrating its mo molecules at a rapid rate, allowing it to seemingly phase through solid matter and leaves pursuers confused. So it seems like it must it would be like a psychic type or whatever it is in this game, I forgot again. Um, it feels like it would be a psychic type, not really electric, but I understand the electric to like phase through like something, so maybe like electric mine, but I think it's pretty cool. Again, we've been, I've been waiting especially for this one for a long time. Also, I like the little artwork that they have now for um, monsters. I feel like they should have like, done this a long time ago, but it's like, kind of like a little pixel sprite, uh, like, sp sp like, um, Pixel sprites? Is that what you call them? Or is it just sprites? But I like the little sprites that we have for them, so there we are. Also, there are more rewards, which I definitely want to try and get all of these, so that might be really, really cool. But anyway, I think that's where I'm going to leave it off. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.